This is the St. Matthew training video on the dishwasher. The dishwasher right now is off and it is empty. And the first thing we need to do is close the drain, which is this lever right here. So we'll push that down, close the drain. Next thing I do is close the doors, make sure they're down. And at the same time we're going to turn on the power and push the autofill button. You'll notice this system is turned on. It's dispensing soap. Here's the soap container right here. The system is spraying water up into here, dissolving the soap, and it's going into the dishwasher down the tube. Now the rinse aid is going. It's pumping the rinse aid into the dishwasher. The rinse aid is in a big jug underneath, big five gallon bucket, and the soap are in the cases in the boxes. Okay, there we are. Our dishwasher is full of water and ready to begin washing. So we'll grab one of these trays. We spray off our dishes, line them up, put them in. Now you don't have to have this tray. I mean, if they're big pans, you can just set them on there as long as they don't fall down into where the, the arms are. All you have to do is close the door and automatically starts up. After the dishwasher cycle is complete, you can open the door and you'll have clean dishes. Bring them out on the other side, allow them to air dry. One thing you want to notice at the top of the machine are the gauges and they tell you how hot it should be for washing and how hot it should be for the rinse. So um, after you fill up the dishwasher, you probably have to wait for the elements to heat up and heat the water before you can start washing dishes to reach those temperatures. Now to shut down the dishwasher, we just go up here to the top, we turn the power off first, then we open the drain. It all come out. Then usually after we're done we can take these screens out that are in here, wash them off, rinse them off before we put them back in. Alright, that concludes the video on how to use the dishwasher.